All right, let's -a go. Update. Is there an update? I mean, that might not be. Nintendo games sometimes don't, but we'll see. Ready for this? Mm-hmm. Let's continue after Pikmin 3. I have no idea what's even happening in it. Oh my no. gosh, Liz is calling. Hold on, we're muted in a second. Okay, and then, man, we're back. <laughs> we have returned. We have returned. You sure you don't want to be on the camera again? I know, because I'm very sleepy. Sleepy So bro. if I do fall asleep, at least... Yeah, he's falling asleep. He's fine. Has she very interesting he's falling asleep during the day. <laughs> That's interesting. That's new in the series, right, Moro? What? Ads! <laughs> mm. Ads! Oh, you know what that means. Uh, I'll do it for you, Ed. Where is it even at? Anyway, there it is. <laughs> <laughs> what about that one? <laughs> Are you serious? <laughs> Did you make a noise? <laughs> Look, I had to wait. Oh no, Ace! <sighs> Ace! What is happening? Uh, wheels again? Well, not gonna be Hot Bean Boozle, that's for sure. Moral got it again. Alright, three, two, one. Moral, please. Are you trying to keep Moral away? <laughs> That's totally what's happening, probably. Do, do, be, do, do, do. Oh, that's right. It's 
Wait, that just means it's your turn to have the hot bean? That's right! It is per person one hot bean a day. <laughs> look at that look you can't see. <laughs> Dang, it's totally quiet. So does that mean the bean is yours? I already had a hot bean boozle. No, regular. I'm bean. exempt. If you get, if you get a boozle, oh, make yeah. it like a regular? Yeah. I mean, it's possible. But I mean, I think everybody did like it when you had it. That all depends. Maybe they'll give it to me. You had your fun already, right? Well, it looks like it's gonna be. A Bean bit. Boozle! Who's gonna have it? Woo woo woo. Yep, there it is. It's official! Yeah, yeah, Majin what Majin says. Moral, Moral added an old bandage flavored bean earlier. <laughs> I think I'll let Moral take a nap and let me have the bean. Wow! Ace, Yo, you're, Ace! You're the best Ace! Yo, Ace! Can I connect? Can I, can I, can I do it? Alright. Where? <laughs> <laughs> I didn't do this again. <laughs> Anytime oh, now. The, can you just open the top? Open the top? Yeah. Yeah, there we go. Okay. Right. <laughs> I did one handed too. <laughs> Alright. Alright, guys. Oh boy, here we go. Oh, that's two. You might have to tilt it when there's so many of them. Okay. So like one kind of slides out. That's zero. There's one. Uh oh. Is that brown? Oh, that looks like it could be liver and onions. Liver and onions are gonna be cappuccino. Mmm. Mmm. Oh, you want some more beans yourself? No. Oh. All excited there. All right, here we go. You had liver and onions, all right. <laughs> <laughs> um, oh, gross! Jesus Christ! <laughs> oh my God! I thought you said liver and onions was all right. Not <laughs> in the bean form. <laughs> <laughs> I thought you barely even sense it. No, oh, I smelled it when you decided to blow it in my face. Well, yeah, that was the whole Especially point. going up my nose. Oh, go ahead, go. What? I didn't for the nose? What are you, you talking did. about? You went We're into my nose. They need a bean for that? What? Or for someone cooking sheep, sheep brains? brains? What does that even taste like? I still wish it was a cappuccino. Kind of alright, but it's kind of like... Uh, this looks so good, doesn't it? It's very pretty. Now we're playing. Here we go! I gotta think of other things for Mystic to eat because he's already getting used to all this. I am? Mm. I think it's time for Moral to have some so she can be on equal footing. No. So what happens if there's a versus, me versus her? <laughs> any, any sort of flinch and you lose. Oh god, no. <laughs> Rescue shipwreck castaways from an uncharted planet to help them. Sounds very similar to three. Two? Two was all about that, making money or something like that, right? And obviously one was the very one to get rid of her out. Well, we'll see. Hi, Shadow. Isn't that nice? Look at that. It's so... It the, that, that's probably why I'm half falling asleep because the music is so nice. It's beautiful. Well, don't worry. I'm gonna play now. The process save automatically. The P icon will appear at the top left corner of the screen. It's saving the progress. Two players? Do so you actually want to play this, or you just want me to play? At least for today, you play. It. You could. We could change it, right? Towards two. I think you can just change it whenever. All right. Well, just one for now. Yeah. That, next time. That's sure. right. They were mentioning about two players. 
Look at that Pikmin stride. <laughs> Shadow, what are you doing there? Very fun game? What, Pikmin? Yeah, it is. It's fun. Yeah. You should play. Wow, that's a load, by the way. Mystic is having fun shaking me back and forth on this chair. Look at that. Look at that. Man, it's a spaceship called the SS Dolphin. Oh, this is literally like talking about the first game. Shadow? This is a story uh, of how I crashed doing? into an unknown planet. Shadow. And how I was ultimately rescued. Wait, was he in the third one? It's been so long since I played it. Him and his brother, I think it was, right? After the crash, I woke up to find my ship was in pieces, scattered everywhere. So you're kind of getting... This is sort of what happened at the beginning of one, I think. I had no way... Uh, I thought I was doomed. I know, but there's a cutscene. It's going so fast I didn't even miss the last text. I didn't even I don't even know what we said before that. Bloop. I like it looks like a drool at the bottom there. <laughs> kind of a strange species. Name is the picture. So <laughs> Uh, uh. That's definitely not like one. <laughs> There's no dog there. Happy puppy. Mm. Wow, uh, oh, they'll be. No, no, that's not gonna happen. Yet. They're durable. They know what they're doing. <laughs> Puppy. Yeah, I know, right? Wasn't that pretty cool? Huh. Windows, Mara, Rivari, Kevna. Left to explore? <gasps> Whoa! Like she went in a house? A place called a house? Oh, what? Huh. So is this like an ultimate universe? Or I don't. That's so weird. Or did he go back to the planet? No, he crashed there. I'm kind of confused right now. Something about this area is different from the others we've explored so far. <laughs> the dog's like, mm. Wait, where are you running off to? Oh. Oh. <laughs> Can't be good son. The pigments don't usually scurry off like that. I suppose we'll have to call them back while I search for the missing ship parts. No, 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 no. Just two feet for him? Yep. But he's still got a leaf tail. Oh, whoa. I can ride him. What is this madness? I saw some of the pigments. I don't know up this way. Could be hiding behind those things. Let's break and see. When we jump, I'll start charging up my pup strength. And I just need to press X and hold down X, I'm guessing, and then aim. And then it'll be a rush. Okay. Very good. <laughs> there they are. By the way, those are Pikmin. No. <laughs> oh, I knew it. 
Now I'll use the bead to call the, my whistle, yep. I kind of get an idea how this plays. But the dog is definitely all new. I just wish I knew why the Pikmin ran off and hiding in the first place. Hmm. I better make a note of this in my voyage log. Uh, now? If our we have to do it later? I never know what kind of information would prove useful. No! How to phrase it. <laughs> <laughs> Olimar. You know Olimar, right? It's like an anagram for, for Mario. But yeah. Uh oh, dings! Strange pick from behavior. Number 76? Ah. Uh, uh. Yeah, they hit. I kind of got the gist of that. <laughs> I need to find my missing ship parts. But it would be much easier if I had more Pikmin to help me. Oh, freaking reminds me of like Arietti. <laughs> we have to watch that movie sometime, Moral. We do. Uh, oh. I guess we're just looking for them. Oh look, I found a few of them. Ooh. <laughs> the way they're done. Whoa, yellow ones! I guess I got those, yeah. Ooh, Moral's fast asleep already. <laughs> Ninety-nine. No pork fart around here. We should be searching the area below. Oh, and then I guess we can get back up. I was gonna say, how do we get back up there? Whoa! Wow, they can hang on there really well. I feel the ghost. A ghost stop. There they are! There's paintings! I'm the rush. The Francisco rush. Oh, that's cool. Yeah. I guess I have to go down there. Maybe? Yeah, and then they stick up. Ah, uh, there is a jump. Okay. That's a that is kind of interesting. Mm -hmm. Very interesting. Oh, I found them. Mar Mario, yeah. Mario. What the hell? But that's actually funny. There's like painting grass on the side here to make it look like. <laughs> For you, it's like grass and all that. Wait. Arrow? Oh, aerial view? Oh, like this? Okay. I got it. It's freaking action packed, right, Moral? Yeah. Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> Ah, uh, you're good. Oh, there's... There's more. What? Okay. There has to be a ship part around here somewhere. This is the perfect situation to rely on my pup's powerful nose. Struck down one of those ship parts. Girl. That's a girl. 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 Right button to press for that. Oh, it's smoky. We need to stay on that scent. Once we have enough of these. Gimme, 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 gimme. Oh, that's actually very interesting. Oh, the Lord are trying to get a bird Makes me think, you've seen Honey, I Shrunk the Kids, right? Oh, yeah. Remember how it was, like, like really awesome to see how it is, like, um, you know, running around, like, in that background or in the house? It makes me think uh, a little bit of that with this series. Uh oh! What creature is this? <laughs> like it's a creature? I don't see any ship parts. Could that thing have swallowed one hole? 
Those spiky things are going to make this tough. I have to find an opening. Maybe I should use the X to build up uh, energy so we can rush to the creature when the time is right. In the meantime, let's circle it and wait for a chance to strike. Oh, there it is! Oh no! Get it, get it, get it, get it! Uh, uh. We did it! Mm, high five! Oh. <laughs> there we go. It's okay. You get. It's the. It's still the radio. We located at last. With this back in our possession, I can finally call for help. Saving checkpoint achieved. Yeah, I should. I definitely want to get like Pikmin 1, 2, and 3. Could definitely pick up 3. This is already a physical version. Then get 1 and 2, and then this one. That'd be cool. I'll have the whole collection on one system. What would be cool is if. You can get, get one that's like all the games on one cartridge? That'd be cool. I have recovered the beast of the radio. Oh. I immediately sent out an SOS signal. And attached the latest version of my voyage log. What happens if I didn't do that one thing? <laughs> Days and weeks pass. One month later, my signal reached the rescue corps. Uh-oh! <laughs> took off uh, towards the remote planet with noble plans to bring me home safe. Unfortunately, fate had other ideas. Oh, they crashed too. <laughs> the rescue officer said to rescue me crash landed during their arrival. Double shipwreck, shipwrecks are rare and extremely unlucky. <laughs> At this point, you might think that all hope was lost. But there was one last rescue officer left at Rescue Corps HQ, a rookie. You. That's right, you are my last hope. Emergency mission! Emergency mission! Rescue the rescue the rescue <laughs> I'm dying here. That's actually kinda of funny. Mm. Following emergency protocols, all officers were directed to uh, evacuate uh, the spaceship immediately. <laughs> Finding the dispensed rescue corp is now your top priority. <laughs> Create your ID badge and deploy immediately. Sure, yeah, I guess so, Flo. Oh, I'm making my own character. No. <laughs> like, how much of a difference can I look? <laughs> um, I guess that. Oh my god. <laughs> Pluses. That almost looks like glasses. <laughs> Why not? Change your look later anyway. Yeah, probably that one. Oh, change the color. Well, blue! Hello! <laughs> Oh, I'll oh, look this purple for you. I think it's all blue. Don't put that mouth open this far. <laughs> yeah, Mystic Mike, that's me! That's first! Yeah, that's our first one where we actually create our own character. Uh, instead of a story driven one. Oh, I know. <laughs> it's gonna be funny in those cutscenes. Beautiful. I wonder what Moral's character will be. 
Male. What? Don't you want it to be female? No, the male's here. Oh, I thought you said your character would be male. No! <laughs> <laughs> the timing of that was nothing short of miraculous. <laughs> oh my god. Keep do you keep doing what you're doing because this is good. <laughs> I'm crashing. I haven't seen enough cutscenes, so I don't want to get it yet. It'll be fine. That might care. I'm gonna actually get a, a little nap in. What? Yes. A nap, you say? Yeah. Sleepy, moral sleepy. I'm very sleepy. I can barely eat. Doze. All right. So you'll be back in ten minutes to watch more. Half hour. Half hour. Yeah. All right. And then it's definitely cooking. Yeah. this time. All right, have fun. Woo All right. <laughs> I think I'm putting the headsets on, but nah. I can hear it good enough, all right? Uh, wait. Wait until you see all the names of the treasures. Oh yeah, of course. Well, at least of this game you're talking about with the treasures or just how they are in the game in general. I do like that, yeah. Oh my gosh, that run animation. Yeah, I do like they, they because they don't know what it actually is named. So they make their own up, which is awesome. My phone need charging. Eh. 83 already. <laughs> oh yeah, Tex. Oh. Okay. Yeah, I'm gonna go celebrate my sister's birthday. Um, tonight, so... I only like, at most a couple more hours. But this is at least starting up and then... I guess tomorrow we'll continue more, and then Thursday off to Las Vegas, so until next week, basically. Sunday's up in the air, if there's even a cast. We're coming back Sunday morning, but we might be just so tired. A poochie! Or Ochi. What was the other one's name that Olimar had? This is his first mission too. That <laughs> no, well, that's there's one. Oh no. Found someone in need of rescuing. Blow the whistle. Oh, I see, okay. That was 
one good thing about like, and I got the Pikmin 1 and 2 on the Wii, the pointing actually was really good. It's fine, like, you know, controller only, but it, that would work out really well. Uh, huh? Is that you, Ochi? Those eyes. I think the stars. I was just sure that my SOS signal had reached HQ. So you and Ochi found and rescued me together? That's actually quite surprising. <laughs> I like how short this was. Olimar did not have a dog? What was the thing I just was doing at the beginning of this game, Flo? Whose dog was that? That I was riding. Probably it's that's the the thing that's like that's it's obviously not Pikmin One, but it's making me think like the story in general was Pikmin One, but then he had the dog, and I'm like, is this alternate reality or? You did not see that intro? Yeah, he had he had the dog there. He was inside a house too, so I was like, this is like alternate reality, Pikmin 1. Or this whole thing would be because pff, others didn't come. Probably introduce myself. Colin, communication officer for Rescue Corps. Ba -ba -da -ba -ba -ba. <laughs> And suddenly too. I feel like we're gonna find everyone pretty quickly. Or at least, I guess these are quickly because we need them. My path got cut off of a small landslide, and when my hunger became unbearable, I decided to nap to preserve my stamina. You're our last rescue, right? Our recruit, right? It's Mystic Mike, isn't it? I couldn't be more grateful for you for rescuing me. As I mentioned before, I was the one who sent out that emergency signal. The rest of the rescue corps, well, it was a rough landing. We entered the planet's atmosphere and lost control of the ship. Oh no, what happened? No. I have no idea, of course. <laughs> there were six officers on the ship, but we were separated when we uh, eject from the spacecraft. We came here to find Captain Olimar, whose own ship had crashed, only to suffer the same fate. It's almost embarrassing. Oh, hey. Game looks so good though. I've confirmed that our spaceship, the SS Shepard, ah, landed somewhere over there. But I couldn't reach it out uh, on my own. Now that you're here, maybe we can find a way back to it. And if we're lucky, we'll come across a few stranded rescue officers along the way. Oh, before I forget, take this. It's a tablet. <laughs> it is a tablet. <laughs> we use them to share information. Thank goodness I carry it around. A smartphone. Yeah, make sure to have a smartphone. We exchange information. Yeah, kind of is. Speaking of information, <laughs> that Twitter logo changed that freaking X. I don't know if the app changed or not. Press up to open and review the mission. Oh, wow. It was not Pikmin 1, this Pikmin 4. Oh, Olimar's fourth adventure, I would guess. Have you played the other ones, Flo? Because... I, I have to play again 2 and 3. I'm like, I think 3 did have reference or something at the very end with Olimar and... The other one that's like Luigi-like, I forgot his name, I think. I don't think 2 had it. Maybe they had him in just a recap. I don't know. I'd have to double check. Alternate timeline, yeah. Ever? Oh, You think he might at some point? Louie. Louie, Louie. But let me take a look at this. Ah, uh, pick him. All in Mar. Yeah, I mean, if I had more time, I would have played the other ones to catch up on this, but it's... I've played them, and it's simple enough. Um, 
<laughs> First game, Pikmin. Last game, Pikmin 4. Obviously, we played him with him. But is he in 2 and 3? I guess. Search for Louie. There he is in Pikmin 3. Captain Lamar is present only as a plot element, but is playable character in some mission modes. Is Pikmin 2's plot device? I don't know. one I guess it's kind of there I guess I don't know he drinks more juice then I guess he's not there in the in the second one. Oh wait he's the main character in Pikmin Pikmin 2 and hey hey Pikmin so he's like in every game huh but up there it didn't say. Oh, Alamar appears as a supporting character in Pikmin 3 and 4. He... So he was a main character in 2? I have not played 2 in a long time. <laughs> I remember more of the gameplay than like the story. Other than making money, obviously. Okay, so he's all in there. So, yeah, it must be a fourth... Yeah, his fourth going to this planet or whatever. I uh, use this app anytime to confirm what task is top priority. I have some other handy apps to share, but I'll solve them later when you have a moment to rest. For now, just remember that you can always press that for missions. But if you press minus and select shortcut settings, you different. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, I just pretty much I think the way it is. Oh. Oh. Still missing. I like there's Rescue Corp and then Olimar and Olimar. Louis, yeah, that's right. Okay. Okay, that's cool, Flo. Yeah, I would like to get Pikmin 3 on Switch. I don't have it yet. Yeah, and I do want to get 1 and 2 reserve. Oh, yeah, for, for the Switch. That'd be nice to have all four in one. Now then, let's go find the SS Shepherd. Look <laughs> at the camera. There she is, the SS Shepherd. I can see the ship, but I have no idea how we're going to reach it from here. You know, there's something familiar about this area. I remember something. It's just up ahead. Let's go. Planet. Plants on this planet are gigantic. Always make sure the area is safe with this thing. Look, that's it. See that big hole in the ground over there? If only we could find a way there. Wait, wasn't it covered in dirt? <laughs> now I'm thinking about it. Find a way there that we could finally reunite with the SS Shepherd. Oh, oh, what? Yeah, over there. Okay, okay, I got it now. I can't jump. This game does look really good. There's something under this dirt. Diggy diggy dig. Dig a tunnel, dig a tunnel. This is the perfect job for the rescue pup. But no. Oh, and good job. Keep going. You're hitting the metal. <laughs> what is he doing? It was plastic. <laughs> I don't know why. We did it! 
Ah, oh, looks like uh, it's another hole we saw. Well done! Oh, gee. Well, hey. I wonder if these two holes are connected somehow. Hey. Looks pretty deep. We're just going to have to dive right in. For real? Let's go. We must act with courage in the face of any danger. Though it does look pretty dark down there. Alright, press A. Enter. Oh, quick before the hyenas get me, I know, right? So this is like Pikmin 2. There was no subterrain stuff in 3, right? But I definitely remember them in 2. Hey, what is it? He's trying to tell us something. Perhaps another officer is here. No, not in 3, yeah. Looks like I... Oh, I thought he said he was dead. <laughs> what? Let's try another round. <laughs> Monsters! Oh, there he is. Oh my! What a place to find the captain! That terrified individual you see over there is the captain of the team. Look sharp. Hello? Captain comes from a long line of... <laughs> oh boy, this is no time for a history lesson. Hurry up and do something! <laughs> Cutscene. Swapping characters. Yeah, I do remember that. Now we can relax a bit. Captain, we took care of the creatures down there. Can you get down? I hope so. My arms are almost numb. You're gonna fall. I mean, you're gonna go down anyway. Oh! <laughs> hey, what's up, Crib? Mystic New Game Hype? Yeah! Have you played this one yet, Crib? Or not yet? What's your status? Are you okay? Did I ask you that? I'm just relieved to see you're alright. Oh, you! I haven't seen you since rookie training camp. I'm Captain Shep- uh, I'm, I'm Captain Shepard of the Rescue Corps, if you don't remember. Did you order Ochi to get rid of those creatures all by yourself, Mr. Mike? Huh? She's not supposed to obey anyone, puppy. Guess that rookie training paid off after all, didn't it? You know, first time I saw you in the training, I had a feeling you'd make a top-notch dog trainer. Saving up and playing other stuff. Yeah, sounds good. Dude, I can't wait for Mario RPG. Are you hyped for that one? hyper roo Sorry to interrupt, Captain, but uh, what were you doing down here anyway? Well, exploring the surface, I discovered a suspicious hole, and uh, I leaned over to take a look inside. Down we go. <laughs> I wandered around the cave trying to find an exit when I came up to those icky, slimy creatures. Hang on, did you fall down the hole located near the SS Shepherd? We entered that cave uh, in an attempt to reach that very opening. Well then, what are we waiting for? Let's get back to the Shepherd. Copy that. Never copy that. Something wrong? You didn't say anything. Copy that. <laughs> As a way of saying understood. Let's try saying it together. Okay. Copy that. Copy that. Understood. I should have said understood, actually. Omega hype? 
he said Omega, and I'm just thinking about how Kochi's beat uh, Final Fantasy V. I need, I need to do the... Like, there's a lot of those games I have not get retro achievements for yet. I need to do it. I want to, at some point, play Final Fantasy Pixel Remaster. some point it's going to happen. Definitely have plenty to keep me busy, that's for sure. How you been today, Krimmers? How was that day off? I hope it's cooler for you there. That said, we'll need to review the Rescue, George, uh, rescue Journal in your upcoming mission. Essential work. Install complete. That almost looks like a like a um like a skill tree, <laughs> character tree. You'll be able to rescue or access them via the tablet. Blah 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 blah. Doge and you have bonded. I officially approve of your partnership. I'll uh, I'll be observing you uh, both to see what skills you have and rescue the truck training. La la la. I think the last 10 minutes you have said... 10,000 hours of gaming? Probably... It... It could... It, it possible. <laughs> we did it! What a rush! Don't worry, there'll be like 10,000 hours of casting still for the rest of the year, right? <laughs> Remember this area? Oh, he fell over there, probably. How did we get up? <laughs> That's where I fell. My word. I think you survived from a fall of that height. But more importantly, how are we supposed to climb up there? Probably that. That makes sense. <laughs> Almost fully charged. Yeah. And we're out. Excuse me, Mystic Mike. I suggest you exercise a bit more cautious when entering something unfamiliar. Maybe don't just touch it. <laughs> I completely agree. Though in this case, your impulsive behavior did get us out of this cave. <laughs> Beautiful. <laughs> then officially plan it. Yes! That is report, please. We located and rescued one castaway, and, and no other individuals are found during the search. Noted! Then, let's consider the investigation of this cave completely. I hope this experience will help you prepare for the challenges that are in your work. There are lives depending on it. But we both did good work today. Well done. I guess we're just going to skip right over the fact that we had to rescue the captain herself? Colin, you look different since the last time I saw you. Did you do something new to your hair? I don't think so. I don't, can he even open his helmet to do stuff? <laughs> I've been a bit busy trying to, you know, stay alive. Oh, of course. And good for you. You did it. Well, here she is. That's a shepherd. I was going to say something. <laughs> I can't remember. Oh, how is this, uh, for those that have played this, I guess, at least so far, what would you rank this compared to the rest of them? Or, like, which is your favorite, pretty much? 
Is that smoke pouring out of the SS Shepherd? All of us will get run away. Famous last words. <laughs> Badass report. Avon investigating the interior of the ship. I discovered the engine has overheated. And that the spaceship was seconds away from total destruction. Oh gosh. Oh no. Will it be okay? It will. I initiate emergency shutdown and everything's stable. Thankfully, the engine can be repaired. However, the ship's energy stores are now completely empty. So we have no way of getting off this planet? Let alone searching for Captain Olimar. Not necessarily. I think I saw something in Captain Olimar's voyage log that may prove useful. Here it is. Take a look at this. <laughs> Good. Download all this stuff. Found treasure. Oh yeah, they're, they're what Olimar said. That's actually pretty good. This is actually, overall, this is actually pretty good. It's like, you got to see how it was at the beginning with Olimar. And then you're getting notes of what he found. And you have more of a con connection instead of just only hearing that he went. But it's obviously a good idea that, you know, you get this kind of information. Hmm. Yeah, that sounds about right. <laughs> In layman terms, we should be able to extract sparkling from sparkling objects that we find on this planet and convert it into energy. If they can be used to restart and restore the SS Shepard, those objects truly are nothing short of a real-time treasure. I'm skeptical, but at this point, we have nothing to lose. This may be our only chance. So, from this point on, we have a new mission. Find and collect all the sparkly objects. Let's copy that. Copy that. And copy that. Apparently, spark, uh, sparkly objects can be used as an energy source located at... As many as you can find and restart it. Okay. Once we collect this treasure, we'll be uh, well on our way to transport it. Uh, for that, we can use the SS Beagle. <laughs> we just need a good place for it to land. Huh? What's that over there? It's so shiny. Is it? Is it like those uh, those uh, RTSs? You know how you have like units to collect energy, something like that, maybe, right? Maybe it's some sort of landmark, but I'm not completely sure. It looks like the perfect spot for a base of operations. Call the ship over. SS Beagle responding successful. Good, our preparations are complete. Let's find that treasure. Uh, oh! Sparkle! Is that what I think it is? This has to be the treasure. Just look at the way it sparkles. Let's check the tablet to see if it's emitting a high energy reading. Alright. Oh, the radar map. I always love- that's the only funny thing with this. You got the plus, and I'm always like- I'm thinking it's the d-pad. Like, press a button on the d-pad or something like that when it's really the plus or something like that. It is what it is. <laughs> Look this way. Excellent work. Yeah, how are we gonna move it? Pikmin time or puppy time.
What could that thing be? So he's worth like three Pikmin, basically. <laughs> Treasure's large. How can we physically collect something this big? The ship uses a special type of light ray that miniaturizes objects during collection. So it shouldn't be a problem. I'll examine it with the sensors on that says Beagle right away. Let's hope it contains the type of energy we need. That's a lot of energy. If we can collect 250 more units, we'll be able to restart the SS Shepherd. But the SS Shepherd is supposed to run on high octane energy. Will this work? I believe we can get it to run on sparkliums alone, though it may be a bumpier ride. Before that can happen, we're going to need a lot more. Huh. So basically, the ship is kind of alright, we just need energy and it just the random items or whatever. Interesting. It's like, oh, what do we got over there? Shiny. I'm guessing up and over. What do we got here? What's this? Is it treasure? Go puppy go! Gee, I wonder what it could be. Look how I run. That's <laughs> so funny. Wait! Oh? Surprise? <laughs> What's up, Vanderman? Huh? It moved. I don't think it's a treasure. No. What could it be? It looks kind of like a plant. Could this be that thing Captain Olimar wrote about in his journal, Voyage Log? He called it an onion. If this is an onion, then what is that spout? It is the flagship item! Red the Pokemon! Oh my! I think this could be a Pikmin. According to Captain Olimar's Void Log, they're friendly and helpful creatures. Well then, maybe they could help us while we explore and look for treasure. Look at that! Ochi's already bonding with the Pikmin. You should introduce yourself as well. And, um, Captain, how long do you tend to hide back there? <laughs> oh, I see. A trash can? Wait, 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 wait. Was that trash can in the corner treasure? Trash is treasure? So, do we treasure uh, that trash can, the trash bag Pokemon? That's something amazing? Krim was right all along. <laughs> what a mysterious life form. Sorry! Nannies? 
Thanos. Super mutant. Suddenly, I like how they sprout. Take you, and you, and you. I guess once you do one, it'll just do the rest. Something shiny. With the Russian? Because they have to. Oh, it's not the trash can. <laughs> oh my gosh! Yo, it's a Game Boy Advance SP. I had one of these. I still have one of these. Uh, so good. I actually remember that was about the time. <laughs> no, it's not trash. It was on top of trash. Oh, I see what you mean. <laughs> One man's treasure is another man's treasure? I guess? Yeah, I was gonna say, when I was working at Games for Less, like that year, um, I think it was my boss there, he actually did order a Game Boy Advance SP from Japan. And I got to see it. Um, before it came out, uh, or whatever, he had early access maybe, to know what the product is maybe, perhaps? I'm not sure. Uh, and then eventually got it myself. Just the flip. This was the first one with, the, like, the whole, like, you know, where it's a flip open and close, and... I mean, it could be thinner, but I did like the form factor. And obviously, DS entirely, 3DS, used it. I like the idea that it, it covers the buttons, keeps it safe. Not to mention, you close it, it'll just go into sleep mode. There was some really good stuff with that. It's a DS prototype, pretty much. It's kind of... Yeah. Kind of like how the Wii U is sort of a Switch prototype, in a way. Brings back memories. Did it say what the name was yet? Or when do we see, like, the names? Yo, get over there. Do we have enough? Do I have- oh wait, I have the doggy. I guess pictures for Moral when she wakes up later. <laughs> you know what's really a criminal thing? They're literally gonna dismantle this thing and and uh, dismantle it apart, to get energy to for their ship. That's that's not nice. <laughs> oh my gosh, there's that many more treasures. We need to keep it up. Well, there was that one that was up there. Oh. Wait, how? How did he get up there? <laughs> now I'm thinking about it. Ooh. 
Almost 300, let's go! What was it? Holding the whistle down did that? That jingle in like the other Pikmin game? I forgot exactly. It's been a while. Maybe they cleaned the GBA? Oh, uh, kept the treasure? Maybe. It better be. Huzzah! You two make a fabulous combination. Mystic Mike and Ochi. Copy that. Thanks a bunch! Yes, yes. Keep up the good work. Pikmin are very obedient. They move and work like tiny rescue pups. Now it's time to contract the energy from the trip. Uh, yeah. Yeah, okay, they're taking it from the trip. Okay, okay. Right, there we go. And then it's nighttime. Yeah, I, I don't know much other than apparently you could be out at night. Well, that's new. Energy for treasure will soon be extracted. It'll flow directly to the SS Shepherd. Game Boy Advance. Or Game Boy. Yeah, Game Boy SP Advance. Wait a minute. Oh, yeah, yeah. That's right. Maybe what's Game Boy Advance SP? Sparkle, sparkle. Do we have enough energy to go to the next area? I mean, it always was a little bit until... Oh, it's just enough that it's, it's stabilized. You did it! Basically. Yeah, we did it. Ship's back online. We still don't have enough energy to fly. But now, we can use the radar to look for our mission officers, rescue officers. Excellent, Colin. Boot it up and see if we can pick up any signals. Oh, I'm picking up multiple SS signals. SOS signals. They could be coming from our lost rescue officers and even Captain Olimar. Then we don't have a moment to lose. Time to get rescuing. Stone of Advancement? <laughs> Path Creator? Is it the bell, right? And a, and a funky fork. <laughs> That's interesting. The ship is automatically naming the objects? We encountered unknown objects and elements of our missions all the time. So, I had an, a naming AI installed on our new ship. Sounds about right. Well, in the older ones, it was kind of like, it was named, uh, you know, from, from like Olimar and whatnot. What they kind of thought the items were. In this one, it feels more like something I would definitely see nowadays. You know, like you find some random item, like, you know, um, or whatever, and it could, it could kind of AI name it or something like that. Bike bell. Oh yeah, path creator. Yeah, you're right. Apparently, it was concrete by a f con co-created <laughs> by a famous appraiser. It's more sophisticated than I expected. Pretty impressive. It is neat. But a backup power source probably would have been more helpful. <laughs> probably. I was worried when I saw the smoke billowing from the SS Shepherd. I didn't know how things would shake out. Thank goodness we were able to make the repairs. I've been uh, roughing for it long enough and there's something to be said. We're finally having a proper prepared meal. And you're sure we have enough emergency rations, Colin? We have no idea how long we'll be stuck on this planet. I counted our stock three times, but I can do it again. 
excellent plan. Do it again. Now, tomorrow we'll focus on recon. Oh, that's right. There's the food thingy. The amount of food needed to survive was in the third one, right? Not the second one, I think? Hmm. Definitely not the first. But don't forget to review your missions before heading to bed. Why heading to bed? You should review it before you're gonna leave. Oh, wait, I'll pin it. Oh, now we need 1500. The juice hunt. Second one, there was no like time limit or anything like that, right? Alright, I guess this is everyone. I call the strategy meeting in order. Copy that. Here's the latest status report. As of today, two rescue officers, one rescue pup have been rescued. Thanks for your effort, Mr. Mike. However, the whereabouts of the others, uh, four rescue officers remain unknown. And SS Shepard is out of commission. All things considered, our primary mission, the rescue of Captain Olimar, has run into some roadblocks. Our first priority is now uh, a search and rescue of our fellow rescue officers. This is Mike Ochi. Fly to the area where our raider picked up uh, those distress signals and try to track down our missing personnel. Colin and I will remain on the ship. We'll be providing direction and guidance from there. Don't worry. We'll be able uh, available via the SS Shepherd's wireless communication at time. So, you'll have uh, full support. I wouldn't typically assign so much responsibility to a rookie, but after seeing you in action, I know you can handle it. Plus, you'll be good paws with Ochi by your side. You two have a great team. Captain, what about our search for Captain Olimar? Should we officially put it on pause? No! We may still find him during our hunt for the other rescue officers. I'll keep it on the mission log, just in case. On that note, I hereby call this strategy meeting to be a clue. I'm surprised we're not, like, inside <laughs> talking about all this. Oh, well. Copy that. Triple copy that. It's an unknown planet. Whoa. Like, NPCs to talk to? You know, like a thingy above their heads and stuff? Stuff this report. Oh. Whoa. <laughs> All this playing so far, and it was that little... I mean, there was the underground. Uh, is there a list of the items that I found? Like, I mean, I kind of see it here. I just pointed. The so this whole thing is a. Is it the demo section over now? That's true, I never touched the demo section. True enough. I like you don't have to hold it down. I would just hold enough until it starts. And then they go for the rest. Oh yeah, I didn't even say... I guess the rest of them. <laughs> I don't know. You'll be pleased to learn that I installed a few new apps on your tablet. I'm sure you'll find them... Uh, more than useful when we're out in the field. So check them out when you have a spare moment. Now that you have... Uh, now that we have uh, that sorted out, are you ready to get out there and explore? Then bye for now. <laughs> explore.
Oh. Interesting. Interesting. Keep playing, don't worry about it. That's what I'm doing! Less talky? Less talky? There's nothing but talky for the most part. What do you mean? Oh, the onion's going too. Rise. I think Moral might be awake now. Our first new map. Oh, less talking slash hand holding later. Thankfully, yeah, yeah. This beginning part obviously is is obviously tutorial heavy. I was just thinking like, yeah, because even the the third one had obviously more story and whatnot. I think the second one was less of it. I don't think it was too much. Just you tell you your objective and off you go. And the first one's kind of the same thing too. Just how to play a bit and then off you go, which I like. Because if, like, if I were to replay, I could, of course, I'd skip all that dialogue. On the ball. Come in, come in, here we are. <laughs> oh. See that clock on the top left of the screen? It's set up so you, that the hand will reach uh, the right most in the location oh, sunset. Right. Search for our missing rescue officers during the day, but hustle back to the before dark. Cop. I'm on the job. I'm counting on you. Oh, you probably noticed that the onion accompanied us on SS Beagle. According to the voyage log, the onion also serves as a form of transportation transportation for the Pikmin. We've got a lot to do and take all the help we can get. I think you could put those Pikmin to good use. Do I have any? No. Oh yes. Nice. Nice heads. I mean so far I can I can probably see it. Of course I just started, so hard to say, but I do like <laughs> that is funny. Um, yeah, I can, I can definitely see, uh, possibly, yeah, this is going to be, like, super awesome. What? Oh, there's some of them. Ah, baddies. Careful, there's something up ahead. What do we got over here? It's cute! Pretty rock. Doesn't seem like treasure, but it might be useful. Boys log, you say? into brown clay comes malleable nice Come on. I'm a fair hand with machines but I don't know much about material science if we had our scientists back ah I see I bet he'd be able to make good use of this luckily for now he'll be excited to have something to work on after we find him uh huh. Yeah, I could, I could see this being pretty interesting. It could only take one, huh? Whoa. I remember the first game having like that secret sort of boss character thing. 
did not know about it, obviously, the first time I played it. But it's interesting there are secrets, and I... I don't know if the others really had. Kind of, sort of, but not the same as that, if I recall. The more Pikmin, the better. Stop interrupting me! We got an important detail. That is, you're going to need Ochi's help when it comes to searching for all the officers. Oh, whoa! Y button? Oh, we're using the Y button, you say? Alright, I think I get the gist of that. Organizing your tasks, stretch. <laughs> oh, is that what it is? Ben Dory? That's cool, there's a name for like, basically organizing and getting the max out of your, your, uh, what you need to do. Huh. Ben Dory. Actually, that kind of thing makes sense for this series. You say? <laughs> what the hell were these? Crystals! Flower, huh? Are? They really are mysterious creatures. Oh, up! Oh, gosh! Uh, I can't believe I didn't upgrade or update it. Awesome! Thanks. F wow, there's actually quite a few playing the other games. Thanks, Seds. Oh, what's this? 
Watch out! Oh, thanks, TTV. Squid Kid. I was doing Splatoon earlier. Bingo hype? Yeah, I don't have the bingo thing going here. Uh, I guess we want to go down. I think we do want to go down. Oh, there it is. I entered a cave that looked like the SS Dolphin parts. Oh, looking for SS Dolphin parts. I found a creature that defies the logic of space. It further surprised me by expelling frigid cold air. Imagine if there were a Pikmin that had been a color for the cold air. This would be crazy. That Captain Olimar certainly is thorough, isn't he? <laughs> Those stream elements. According to the log, anything you enter, uh, er, any uh, any time you enter a cave, you should take Pikmin with you. Oh, the Pikmin that remain at the top surface can't uh, be left out here, so let's return to the island for the time being. Lost? Use the map. <laughs> Damage! Oh gosh. Am I actually going to like die now? There we go. I don't have enough right now. I was at the heel. Oh yeah. Do I need to put pick only the Pikmin I need uh, with me and then put the rest away or something like that? It's enough to worry about it right now. Oh, have I even been on this? Actually, oh, map. Uh, the map, you say? Well, that's cool. Oh no, don't go in there. Imagine got carded. How long is a day in this game? Is it... Is it longer than before? Maybe just like a by a little, maybe. Of course, it's looking right at me. Oh, that's a new circle area. I like it's like right where the enemy's at. <laughs> Get rid of the pesky monster. First try. 
Oh. Oh, that's cool. I mean... Can I do it right and not like this? Oh wait, did they turn around and go the other way? <laughs> that's actually kind of funny. Keep a close eye on this creature, but I have a line of sight. I should probably get more and try to bash it real quick. Honey. Oh! Oh, that's cool with the auto lock on. That was that in the other games, or at least three, maybe. Interesting. He's like sleeping during the day. Boop, 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 boop. Was this under construction at some point? I wonder who was working on it. I'm sure we can put the good use to uh, finish it. Seems familiar. What was it like? Happen. Yeah, let me actually knock this guy out first. Wow, that was fast. Teleport. Oh, it's like knocked out for a moment. Okay. What? Did he recover? Oh, he's dead. Never mind. It always kind of looks like there's still the eyes open. Or which game was it that sort of did that? Was it the very original? No, it wasn't the original. It was the third one, wasn't it? Rouse? And he's back. It won't respawn. That's how it was before, wasn't it? Oh, is there like a limit to the amount of Pikmin you can have? Is there even enough time to go down in this? Uh... Okay. Uh, max of 20. Okay, and the rest goes in. Okay, that's cool. That's cool. <laughs> I like that rocket even goes in there. Mystic missiles go in. Rajing left the area. The vicious. Can you just exit? I'm guessing. Oh, castaway set. Oh. 
Oops. Oh, there's a thing. More energy. Not treasure? Treasure or not, it does appear to have sparklings. Might as well keep collecting these those defeated creatures. I never know. up there. Okay, pups. Ooh. Ooh, new treasure found. Oh, that's right. Like in, in Pikmin 2, there was... The time didn't move under here, did it? I could just run through that, huh? <laughs> Soak it up. It was frozen today! The poor thing frozen. Maybe it will respond to a whistle. Pikmon. Frosty. The real treasures are your friends. My friends are my treasure? Is that what it was? That Kingdom Hearts thing. We thought of Pikmin as plant-like creatures, so I never dreamed I'd come across an ice variant. Ice Pikmin can use their icy bodies to freeze water and creatures. But they also float like ice in the water. They float. They float in the water. Ah. Uh -huh. Don't spray them with water, though. They really don't like it. Ah. Uh, so I guess they can't be used in the water. The bodies are made of ice. Who knew that something frozen could move about like this? It's incredible. Huh? That seems like a lot of Pikmin is in your squad bigger than normal. Hmm, I see. When you're underground, you can have a larger squad because of the wild Pokemon you find that would join you. Oh, it's amazing. Take it back. Take it back. Give a good charge. Hey. I don't need to throw it in there, I just run around. Ooh, gold. Gotta let go. Oh, I remember this. Time to push him in. How many did I oh yeah, I'll find out at the end of this day. Hum Oh yeah, how many Pikmin you guys think so I'm gonna lose today? Maybe I should do like a prediction thing. new materials what could this be oh what do we got over there Ooh. I'll lose at least one yeah you'll definitely be right on that does it look like it's it looks pretty pale for an onion. What do you think? Can we take it with us?
When there's always a thing mentioning about something, you do it because that that is the thing. I guess I should probably... He digs faster, I'm guessing, right? Oh, we got toothpaste or whatever that is. <laughs> Kido! Kitty! can get everything. I think there's gonna be like a boss fight or something coming up. So far, because of course I'm still playing this, but so far, yeah, I would probably say this is the best, the best Pikmin game thus far. Um, it has a nod to the first one. It has the undergrounds, like the second one. Um, and it expands more, more characters, I guess, for like the third one. You know, you're not changing characters, but it do it's kind of doing its own thing. Time to knock that out? You got a little buddy. What are you this done to? Oh! Just like that! Frozen solid! I bet you could break it- Oh, if you hit it now! Oh boy. Oh boy. That's cool! Because there's a time limit on that. Oh! Oh, good morning! Moral's back, everybody! This is a lot of fun. You gonna watch now? You're back? How do you feel? I feel a little bit better. Uh, so, uh, you want one? Oh! Yeah, I'll take one. Hit it before it falls! Yay! <laughs> <laughs> See this? Uh. You have your little guys to- oh! Remember it's frozen, so... Frozen? Okay, well then I can wait a moment on that. <laughs> then take it back here. They're underground little segments. This is from Pikmin 2. This is awesome! Let's get these two back. Alright, let's Spit them out. <laughs> Spit them out. I think we found our next rescue corpse to rescue. <laughs> corpse? Rescue core. That's what they're called. You know, the, with oh. the, the P at the end. We found a castaway! Oh wait! No, that's not Olimar, is it? Hurry and check their vitals. Pulse, blood pressure, temperature, all within normal parameters. Look like their life support system is doing the job. We should uh, transport them back to the SS Beagle and verify their ID badge. Uh, we need three, three ice ones? Or it doesn't matter. Yeah, you need three to move it. It's a little bit like, sort of RTS-like. But more, more uh, friendly and more interesting. You know, not like you're just guns. You have units running around or whatever like that. Uh, oh wait, should I open? Do I have to open this thing? I wonder. Maybe. Whoa. You did it! Let's take a look and see the ID badge that it tells us. <gasps> hey. This is Russ from Rescue Corps Officer. There actually literally is Rescue, the Rescue Corps, <laughs> which is funny. The inventor. Oh, thank the stars, he's all right. This is Russ, the scientist in charge of the repairs and upgrades of our spacesuits and the SS Shepard. His technical knowledge will be beyond helpful uh, during this rescue mission. Found the scientist! We found another one! Yay! Yeah. You can over limit carrying things. Oh yeah, they'll run faster though if you add more than the three or whatever. Yeah, true enough. I guess we're all done there. Are we all done? Back to the surface? I guess I don't have to worry about picking up those Pikmin, right? Or do I? Maybe you uh, should go check and you can take them. Uh, go collect them. This is a cool little like world and whatnot. Like there's that broken like pipe over there. Or a uh, pot, I mean. Mm -hmm. 
Oh, it does? Oh, 100%. Yeah, you're right. It does say it. Yeah, obviously, in this case, we're done. Obviously. Back to the surface. Take my current outside your squad. We'll oh. Come with you. Ah. Well, now you know. Now I know. I think so. It was the same thing the other way around, too. Whoa! This little air drain thingy. A little mystic missile just comes right back with us. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, we rescued one. Ah, ah, ah. Any treasures? We found treasures. It's... Refreshing goo? Yeah, refreshing goo. And there's the director of destiny. <laughs> I like... Uh, these games are always funny because they have all these, like, common items for us. But they find it as big, you know, things to take back there. But they don't know what it's called, so they, they think of these crazy naming schemes or whatever. Oh, it's funny. I like it's, it, though. It's really like it. Investigation complete! Da -da 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 -da. Back to the surface. Now load. Now load. Uh... Mm. Nice and cool. That Pikmin stride is real. We're back on the serpent. Oh. I'm sure I synchronize your clock, Mr. Mike, but something's off. No? I've calculated a difference. It looks as if about one-sixth of as much time passed on the surface when we spent underground. Oh. This is not like the second game where it doesn't move. Or maybe it was, I don't remember. Time seems to move differently in the underground spaces on this planet. I'm not sure how it works, but I suppose that means that you can take as much time as you need to explore the caves. Yeah, that time in the corner, that's uh, until it's sunset. Ah. So, I guess you can't do anything in the, when the sun sets? No, there's evil creatures at night. At least that's how it was in the first three games, but in the trailer for this one, something, I guess, happens and we're able to be out at night, but I guess not yet, so... I'm not sure how that works yet. We'll find out. Oh, hey, the onion sucked it up. <laughs> I see. Uh-huh. The voyage log says that the white bulb is called... Flar Flarlic. Flarlic. <laughs> we bring the Flarlic to the onions. It will increase the number of Pikmin it releases into the surface at any time by 10. Ah! Whoa! That'll be a big help when we're exploring. Try taking out more Pikmin. Um, do I need any more ice ones? Oh. So I can have told. Uh huh. I don't know if I need more ice or not. Maybe just. <laughs> that. I don't know. You vacuum your house with an onion once, it sucked. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. Look at this overworld. What do you think of it? It's very interesting. Very pretty. Mm-hmm. Okay, what time is it ticking? Where were we? How are we doing this? What's going on? Uh, yeah, we started here, and then we went here. And we were there. That was it. What star- what did the stars mean? They're those treasure things. Maybe I could see if I can get that one, which is... <coughs> like, that thing, I think, was. Why did I get back over there? Uh... Can I reach it with the right ones? The red ones are higher up, right? Right. Uh, uh, uh. 
to get up there. Dang it! Scooby, please! Are they- <laughs> were they actually attacking the wall? It looked like they were. Ooh. Oh, there's something to bash over there. Yep. Yay! Oh, there's a bridge over. Oh, 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 oh. Break, break. Oh, more pickups. Ooh, treasure. All that. Can I? Oh, I see. Ah, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Oh no! There's bugs. Take them out. Take them out. And then take them back to the base. Tuck back to the base. Do 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 do. Does it actually show? Yeah, it kind of shows where they're going. Yeah. Oh. Uh oh. One of those. Oh. One of those guys. Oh wait. Oh. Cool. Uh, I think I need only. Is only. Ochi can do that? I don't remember. Wait. Hello? Is there anything put on that? Come on! Yank it up. I guess I could throw more to help. Hey, we got a thing. Nice. Pop it up. Pop it up. Oh, that Pop one needs two more. Oh no. Oh, you're right. Well, that's all, everything I have. <laughs> oh, look at the time. <laughs> oh, this is the freeze frame. <laughs> An important part of any mission, rescue mission, is making sure that uh, you make your way back to the base before it gets dark. Oh boy. That's the base! According to Captain Elmer's voyage lot, Pikmin will be safe as long as they make it back in this area around the base. Seems the creatures uh, get even more aggressive at night. If any Pikmin are separated from the squad, you better collect them now! Hurry up! Oh, oh! I make it in time. Oh, there's a yellow one. Uh, I don't think I'm gonna have enough time. I don't know how fast it's going. Wait, what? Uh, huh? Something died? No, why is there like a death counter? What does that mean? Are enemies or something? Uh, oh, is that how many? Are gonna die. That's probably what it is. That yeah. they're, they're out and about. <gasps> oh. Oh. Kind of. Oh, oh, oh. I can grab some more real quick, real quick. Uh, uh, go, 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 go. I'm chancing it. Is it? Oh my gosh, the timer. Uh, uh, it doesn't look like, yeah. There's nothing I'm missing here. You can end today's, uh, today's session. I want to turn it in first. Uh... Okay. <laughs> Rewind time. Wait, end day, right? Ready? Ready. Never- wait, never saw what in, in your game? I'm guessing the, uh... Your first real day? Yeah, I know, right? There was a lot of, like, dialogue and... Oh! Ah, oh, the classic ending. The, the day music. There they go! They don't show. I remember that like in the other ones, they show like some of the the baddies, nasties starting to come out. Like, but they're like, oh, you're taking off already, so they didn't get you. Or actually, if you left any, they are still down there <laughs> and they're getting chased. Co-op play. He too can toss small stones at creatures. Oh. 
That's interesting. So that's all I can do, really. <laughs> oh, we're back here. Yeah. That's the actual ship. We just made like a second area thing we found. Music's familiar. That was definitely in one of the other games. Rescue! Ooh! A lesser mock bottom. <laughs> You're liking these names. Wait until I get that. Item. Uh. Bestiary. <laughs> Progress 13%! We did it! Welcome back! Glad to see you made it here in one piece! Hee hee hee! Of course, Captain! I had no doubts that the emergency escape system I developed would function perfectly. That may be, but it would have been helpful if you showed the rest of us how to actually use it. One would expect an emergency escape device to be a bit more intuitive to use in the event of an emergency. Anyhow, <laughs> now that you're back, Russ, can you tell us if you came across any rocks, like those rock thingies, like this before that we found? Hee <laughs> Oh, Colin, Colin, Colin! <laughs> Not only did I see them, I've already completed a very thorough research on the material. They discover oh. that when heated, the rocks become soft and malleable. Malleable. That's cool, too. <laughs> <laughs> and can be shaped into any form you desire. Oh, maybe it's for the bridges and stuff. Base properties can even change when exposed to different... Stimuli. Stimuli, yeah. It's quite a uh, versatile raw uh, material indeed. Huh? huh? Cool! <laughs> cool doesn't even begin to describe it. This is the one. The ultimate biomass. I've been searching for my entire career. I've currently upgraded the 3D printers. Oh my gosh. So we could put this miracle material to use as soon as you bring it to the SS Beagle. It will be crucial uh, to my work in the lab and any other building's needs that might arise. What a spectacular update, Russ! I knew uh, bringing along a material specialist would be the key to our success. Starting tomorrow, I'm expecting our rescue operations to go even more smoothly than usual now that you're here. Yay! We're still looking so, for the others. So Van Herman said, uh, never saw the freeze frame of the plant glitching while the cutscene started. Oh yeah. I think the timing, right? Because what was... Oh, because that, that was when it became evening time at the very the very moment. Mm -hmm. Yeah, no, I, that would probably not happen. And I probably would never have seen that either, unless I he's, got really lucky with that. He's not a scientist. He's just a modern-day craft person with AI and 3D printers. That's right. Rescue mission day three. Puppy. Wait! Is it just me or did Ochi go through a growth spurt overnight? That's actually quite typical for his breed. It's a sign that he's now fully grown, qualified for rig rigorous activities! Yay! <laughs> The Pikmin sure are playful today. <laughs> that friggin' stomping him like a Goomba? <laughs> yes, they appear to be letting their guard down now that Ochi's come into his own. I'm just glad to see they're getting along. Right. Any benefit of Ochi being fully grown is that he can now build up his pup drive while completing missions. Yay! And with regular training sessions, he can learn new skills Ugh. that will be useful for everyday rescue operations. From the looks of it, Ochi is ready as ever to fill up that pup drive. <laughs> Alright, officers, to your stations, please. Copy that! 
Speaking of pups, y'all, you should have seen this guy yesterday when we were gonna go get dinner. And he saw a dog whose head was out the window. And he tried to howl at it! Yeah. And? He was so determined I didn't to howl. get it. I did a slight little barking just to see if I could you get his attention. Howl. There was nothing you like that. Howl. There was no howl. You were. It was hardly a howl. It was a howl. I don't know about yes, that. Yes, it was. Uh huh. Here we go. Uh huh. <laughs> uh huh. <laughs> he was determined to get that puppy's attention, and the puppy didn't. Now I call the strategy meeting over. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> Yes, first thing first, Russ, please update us on the improvements being made to the SS Vigo. <laughs> it would be my absolute pleasure, <laughs> Captain Shepard, because they're done. <laughs> oh. Vigo can now use the uh, raw materials collected in the field for clay. Yep, making the bridge, I called it. <laughs> With this functionality, we should be able to easily build. On locations. There was like bridge building in other games, but you're getting the pieces of the bridge that were nearby. And just uh, having it put there. Now that's kind of like, oh, you have this material that could be used for anything. So you can get a little bit more creative or crafty or something, I guess. Mm -hmm. Be interesting. Excellent, of course. I'm not quite sure what we'll be building, but good work nevertheless. Oh, you're going to Tokyo in September? Nice. Oh, you are? Nice! You're hoping to find a lot of Pikmin merch? Nice. Yeah, that'll be good. That'd be good to get some of that stuff. You're gonna walk around there with the Pikmin, like, mobile app? <laughs> <laughs> Watch it be, like, so many, like, flowers or whatever setups or whatever it is. Because there's probably a lot of people playing it there. That'd be actually interesting. Yeah, do it! <laughs> do it! Do it! Fucking treasures! We're counting on you to find them. Come back later to talk. If you have a moment, we'll discover the nice training. Let's go! Copy that! Copy that! Always about the copies. Uh, there's a. Uh... So I guess what. Basic idea was right. Oh, gear and skill update. Woo! Ooh. Lots of new stuff. Yep. We're getting all these peeps. Why does Pochi look like he's on fire eyes and whatnot there? Huh. Gear, you say? It's just skills, from what I'm seeing. Mm hmm. Like tips and tricks, voyage log. Oh, there was. Oh, wait, maybe this one. That's all his stuff is saying. Oh, wow, there's like a whole lot more now. <laughs> Red Pikmin's on fire! No, wait, he is fire! Does have. Oh, yeah, that was that very beginning. That SOS. Oh, the history thing. Yeah, there was a Game Boy Advance SP oh, that wow. I found earlier, yeah. Uh, what was the name of it? I forgot. See, that's the thing. It's like, I guess I'll have to progress more until I can see it, but... I was like, where's the list of all the, those special, like, item thingies or whatnot? Probably not just yet. Here are the missions. <laughs> So obviously we're looking for the last three members, right? Yeah. We're also getting power source, those spark, sparkliums, mm -hmm. which getting treasures and stuff have this like energy to help power the ship so they can eventually move around and then take off. And then obviously the original thing was to find Captain Olimar. Uh -huh. So we have three missions right now. Aha, uh -huh, now you're totally caught up. Holy. Look, I lost zero. We did it. Good job. I'm proud of you. But I, I'd be almost like one. I obviously would like to continue, especially to show you more how it is. Mm -hmm. Like it was definitely flow going earlier. Um, but yeah, there's not that much time. <laughs> I don't want to start now. 
Which... How long do these missions take? Well, I guess... I could just end the day. I mean, we could do it. I guess there's still a little bit of time, right? Yeah. Um... Oh, train? Oh, okay. Explore. <gasps> Visit the lab. It's 5-11 right now. Oh, no! Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. It's like... I mean, I could always stop in the middle of it. Yeah. You want to do that? You want to see a little more, or yes. should we just end it for now? Yes. Yeah. Now you want to see it. Oh well, yeah, I need I needed that nap. So. You did. How does this work? This is all kind of new. Let's tell me how it works. Oh. Oh. Well, side quests, you say? Oh whoa. A scorch guard. Oh. Wow, this Plus, is... it's moisture wicking. Excuse me? <laughs> Who said? Uh, huh? It is. It does say it. Wow. <laughs> Poo! Oh, it just charges them all? Is it like... Is it like you make it and then you have it forever? Or is there a use? Oh, let's try it. That won't, that won't cost that much. Oh. oh! Charging horn! Just tell me the button to press. Oh, X! Oh, okay, that makes sense. Okay. Oh, your entire squad goes. Oh, that's cool. That's different and new. Then Dory Dynamite. <laughs> okay. Uh, well, okay. Well, I can do this. So, yeah, usually like in the other games, you just start the next day and you go or whatever. Well, you pick maybe where you want to go and then you start the day or whatever, but... Mm -hmm. oh, wait. Hello? Hello? Oh, okay, here we are. Let's chat. What area do we want to explore? That's the only one? I wonder. Oh, yeah, I need fifth. Okay, okay, I get it now. All right. Now we go back here and we explore more. Yay! Yay! It is from the other games? Oh, like which ones? been so long it might have been and i just completely forgot off we go let's -a go let's -a go the sun speckled terrace one has been rescued three treasures one onion strutting pikmin yay <laughs> Oh, it just was a name? Yeah, it was like... I guess there was. Yeah. Yeah, I do remember a charge of some sort. Oh, here they call again. Come in, come in. Guess we're in. Jump skill. Oh, yeah, I guess there's jump skills or whatever. Oh, yeah, it should be. Okay, good. I was like, oh, yeah, there was a training stuff. Do I need that to progress or whatever? He can jump. Charge! Oh yeah, the whole mounting oh, thing. Gotcha. Oh, so that charge that you couldn't reach, you probably can get it now. I could probably do it now, yeah. Yeah, that's... Need to pick that Pikmon. Do I need any of these? I don't know if I can get any more. I don't know if I want to use it. There's only 10 and I don't know if I can... Actually, do you, do you get more depending on what the Pikmin is? Now that I kind of think about it. Uh... Let me try that. Let me see. I think it is. 
I think that's what it was, like the majority or something like that. There's water, don't go in the water! Oh, can I just want to go in the water? Oh, look! I produced a different one! Wow! Huh. Oh, and you just jump right back on. That's funny, actually. I like that they're hanging on, too. That's great. Yeah, they're, they're totally hanging on. Where are the rest? Oh, there they are. Is he bashing his head? Yep, he is. That was funny. And these are, like, easy ways to get, like, more Pikmin, basically. Let's see, shall we? And I'm guessing... Oh, not that. Obviously not that. Oh, that's... Okay, right. It's X, right? To jump? Yeah. Oh, hey! Oh, look! <gasps> what is that treasure? It's most amazing. <laughs> Jesus! Find out what it is, right? Oh, hey! Found another thing of a jingy. Oh, this might be a little too high up. Aww. Probably not there. Um, new treasure! Yay! Ooh, got a lot more collection stuff. Alright, let me. I guess I should go. Uh, do I want to go underground? <laughs> Maybe just stay up ground and see what I can progress. And I'll save that for next time. Yeah. There's, uh, can you jump and throw them? Maybe that's a thing you can do. Wait, is there something here? There is something here! What is this? Um. Off they go. Oh yeah, well, I can now. What else do you need? Oh no, guess we'll find out. What the hell? I had it. You can jump up with him. That's right. Well, oh, over because there's a little edge. It's a smaller uh. Five. What edge? Here, you mean? No, other way. It's a little see ledge. Oh, this one. Yeah, but this, it's so far away though. Can you still jump up? Oh no, I can't jump up here. Oh. <laughs> Ow! Oh! Oh, that's a good idea. Mm -hmm. Oh! Yo! Yo! That little beaut. Thank you, thank you. Thank you for that tip. Is there anything on this side? Oh, I guess we were here. Uh, oh. Poop, 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 poop. <laughs> Um, there was something that kind of saying that they could float like water, but I guess they can be on water. Okay. For science. Oh, that's... Uh... Uh, I see they coming towards it. Yeah, I don't know about that. Well, there was stuff, yeah, eventually. There was... Where was I going? Oh. You were going that, yeah. Yeah, I was going around that. Ooh, cool. Wait, little guys. Don't eat my buddies! Take those. Uh-oh. Oh, I ain't going... 
I'm not going that way. I think I need a new, different Wait. type of Pikmin I don't have right now. What's it say? <laughs> oh, yeah, throw? I know. You'll electrocute him, won't you? Yeah, I think so. There's that bridge. It's on this side. Oh. Oh, gosh. Monsters! That's okay. Those are easy. Off they go! I love how you yeet all of them. Yup. It's so- Oh no! Still... Wait, how do I get off? Let's go. Alright, everybody go! Let's go! Oh my gosh, there's a sleepy one there. I'm so glad I was sleeping right now. We're fine. I think we're good. We're good. Oh my gosh. Mystic sending his pick into the death. I didn't do it! Uh, did he eat it? <laughs> yeah, he did. It's just like, blah. I can go back this way, right? Oh, there's a clock up there. <gasps> how, how much do you need to kill that thing? Can you Lenny. kill it? Yeah, you can, but this thing can kill them like crazy. Oh, okay, don't. That's okay, it's okay. Oh, wait, uh... What does it get off, I guess? Because the dog thing is so new. It's charged? Don't go- wow, he died fast with that charge! Holy shoot! Just saw the one I did yesterday with that. Uh, there was definitely some casualty. I don't even know how much I get, had casualties of. I wonder if you can knock into that. Uh, that's probably a good point. Yeah, good point indeed. I could actually just do this. It's noon! Yeah, ow! Oh god. <laughs> it hit me! Why is it hitting me? So it's seven obviously needed to move, but if you add more on top of it, they move faster. Also, this, uh, there was something there you can demolish. I could? Yep, that wall. Uh, not that one, over there. Oh, this one? Oh, yeah, you're right. It is another one of those. Hey, you saw! Alright, he's got it. That <laughs> should take forever. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see how much work he does when I get back with everybody else. <laughs> hey, banging heads on the walls. Isn't that, our, isn't that how we are in, That's through, a, in it's her life? That's a real head banger. <laughs> what are we at? 801. Yeah. And get these and then see what happens. And now, checking back on the pick pin, which is sending his head to the wall. We'll be done, actually. <laughs> <laughs> Not like they just all get on them. Like fleas. Uh, hey, he's doing a pretty good job, I think. Oh my fucking god. I love that the thing they do is that they smash their heads into it. <laughs> Look how some of them are just hanging on there. They're just, let's go! Oh, where are they going? I hope there's no trouble on that side. There go check! Yeah, there's a gap over there. Oh! Is that a new, uh, I think it is! A new underground area. I guess there'll be a lot of that for the next day I do it, which I guess tomorrow, perhaps? Yeah. Item. Okay. Oh, oh what's that? First. Oh, gimme, 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 gimme. And it's just enough to. Oh, even better. Oh, I'll take the shortcut if I actually. Look at that. It's a shortcut. Ooh. Paper bag lowered. Paper bag. Lowered. <laughs> <laughs> they were going 
it that way, and then they realize, oh wait. <laughs> they doubled back once they figured out there was a shorter path. <laughs> That's, oh my god. Oh, that's great. He's like, I can't go up there yet. That's funny. <laughs> oh, huh, huh. It's almost close to the end of the Getting there. Looks like there's one more treasure island. They're smarter than most Uber drivers. <laughs> or, or. Uh, or like, uh, uh, what's it called? Like the search. Oh, there. Ooh, I know what it is. But can we get to it though? It looks is that an onion high. or a, a garlic or? A uh, onion, yeah, it's, a, it's an onion. It's a, it's a, for a yellow version, which I don't even have yet. So I feel like almost, unless there's another way to get up there or maybe, no, I doubt charging it will do it. I feel like I need to get a yellow one first for maybe the underground, and mm -hmm. then come back here to get the onion. That's mm -hmm. my guess. What else I could do? Yeah, with that limited amount of time. Actually, what was that, 39? The bridge. Can I even get up there? Oh! Oh, you just need... the materials to bring out? I think so. Do I have to bring it out, or is it just automatic? Can I even reach it? Oh yeah, I guess I can. But I don't have the time. Whoa! Oh, something's happening. I believe we uh, a vital asset. Ah, clay building, raw materials, this stuff. Once you extract it. Yeah, so you you start building. It, okay, you yeah. build it today. Ah, kill him. Kill him with Pikmin. Probably not. Well, let's see. <laughs> Where are you going? You're totally going to get the material, aren't you? Yep. Uh, can it can it happen? Well, look at the time, uh, man. And well, be progress at least. <laughs> what it was in the other Pikmin games it kind of holy crap <laughs> what's happening yeah I know we might well, good maybe thing for that paper bag yeah good thing for that paper bag indeed go my little workers oh they're making the bridge look at that <laughs> Oh, it's about to go in the red. Uh, 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 Alright, you guys, let's go. Uh, can, I, can I grab these or. Okay. What, do I throw them again? Yeah, looks like it. I, I don't know what's happening. Oh no, hurry up! <laughs> you. 26 are gonna die. Hey, the bridge is done. Now I gotta get everybody and <laughs> get to safety. Hey, the construction is complete. Now I can go there on the next day. Woohoo! Go get him. And... Yeah, we're not going in there right now. Okay, so it's zero. What's it zero? Because all the others are just hanging out at the. Ooh. 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 I'm curious to see what's over there at some point. They're all pretty much just hanging out over here. Well, that went easy, and I got it done on this day. There is like another, like the first Pikmin game or whatever, especially going back and playing, there's this sort of like rush to get as much done in each day and mm. finding the best route and everything. Like when you play it once, you know, you're just enjoying it. But there is something going back and playing it mm -hmm. where you're like, because like in the first one, you had 30 days to basically get everything, all the essential pieces and fly off, right? Yeah. 
Um, but you could, you know, obviously, um, you know, once you get it all, you, you win. So it's kind of like, hey, can you do it in, like, eight days or ten days or something like that? Can you, like, shrink it down a little bit more? But, like, in this one, so far, there is no time limit. The second game was the same thing. There was no time limit either. Third one kind of did, but it was sort of done by the amount of, like, juice fruit. <laughs> you know, to keep everyone fed or something like that. But usually yeah. it was a good amount. I didn't have to worry about it. And another day is done. He's gonna, he's, because he has to end soon. He will do the cake, because he unlocked two of them. Yeah, he I did unlock two, two, but yeah, I have to end now. My yeah. sister's coming to celebrate birthdays and all that. But at least now you got to see kind of a day quickly of, of whatever there. You kind of get it? Kinda. You're a little bit of intrigue now? I do have some intrigue, yeah. You can have, huh? I have some intrigue, yes. Ah, uh, maybe tomorrow I'll show more and you can see? Yeah. We can, we can definitely, there's definitely plenty more to see and whatnot. And I'm curious to rescue the other rescue, you know, rescuers. <laughs> yeah. Rescue the rescuers. Let's see what we've collected. I have to show you like the original one sometime. <laughs> Sun okay. Sunseed Berry. Aspiration Ritual Ball. <laughs> Temporal Mechanism. Double Dragon Eye Scope. <laughs> That's funny. Nice. Now we're almost at a thousand energy things, so we need 1500 to get to a second area. Hey! I think this is specifically everything you can do on that one map. Mm -hmm. Raw materials went down a bit. Well, I mean, you built a bridge. Oh yeah, I did, didn't I? Hello? By the way, if you put uh, a shortcut, different functions... Oh, really? Amazing! Oh, Okay. 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 Mission complete. Oh, there's a side mission too. Hmm, that could be interesting. It was a beefy. Once you reach 1500, that ends the demo. Oh, so this is all still in that demo. Oh, wow. So. I guess that is a pretty beefy one. Now that I'm gonna think about it, I could have actually had some progress, but hey, playing it now, right? There was other stuff to do. So it's interesting that there's like this hub thingy before you start. I'm guessing it auto save, right? I don't have to do anything specific. I'm pretty sure it is. Oh, save and return to title? There you go. I mean, I like that. Are you sure you want to return? You return to the time screen after you recent progress. So it's, yeah, it's more effort save. As in P saved. P save. P saved. P saved. P saved. P saving. Ooh, look how beautiful that is. It is very pretty. 